Let's see. It is 623, March 17th, Sunday. So, uh, it's St. Patty's Day. But, uh, I woke up like... Actually, let me see if I can put this down so I can it can be steady. I'll talk about I'll talk about the weed in a little bit, but uh, let me just see if I can get this kind of steady. Yeah, that works. All right, yeah. So it is like six o'clock in the morning on. St. Patrick's Day, which falls on a Sunday this year, and I just wanted to make a video that I could post to YouTube that was like new content and not like something that, that was filmed like last year, because I'm uploading a bunch of old videos, I'm uploading a bunch of old videos to YouTube that, um, that was like, yeah, it's just stuff I made like about lucid dreaming and like a vision quest and doing some psychedelics and like different stuff um, and I'm gonna re-upload like every single video that I posted because I kept all of them on my phone I didn't delete them because like I felt good about them you know I thought they were good content so I didn't take them down because I felt bad about them I just took them down because I was like okay I'm going to get off of social media in YouTube for a little bit and then I'm gonna hop back on re-upload everything and um, I was I, I, for a long time for a long time I was considering like taking the time to like edit each video and like cut out the pauses in between words you know um, and you know making an intro making an outro and like putting music in the background and like all this stuff but I was just like I was just like man like that shit's not really necessary, like, to get your message across, like, it's just not really necessary, honestly. But, um, but there is something really fun about editing videos, you know, there is something really fun about doing it, you know, um, like, what would I compare it to, like, it's kind of like going to a coffee shop, it's like, the first time you go to Starbucks, like, all you do is look at the, menu, like, you glance over the menu, and you're not exactly sure what all the machines do, like behind the counter, and you're like, oh, I'll just get like a regular drip coffee with, I'll put some sugar in it and some milk and like, that's it. Like, it's basically a super basic drink, but then like, the 50th time you come to Starbucks, like, you come in and you're like, you know the barista by their name and they know you and you're like, maybe you have the rewards app on your phone and you're like, Okay, I'm gonna, like, in your head, you're not saying this out loud, but in your head you're like, okay, I'm gonna get a fucking custom drink, and I know exactly what I want in it, and, like, you, you, it just rolls off the tongue, like, when you tell it to the barista, you're like, I want a large mocha frappo with extra caramel, some froth on the top, and, and added sugar, added milk, or whatever, like, I don't know, because I don't get custom drinks at Starbucks, if I do get coffee, it's just a regular black coffee or a regular medium coffee and I put the cream and sugar in. So it's like, it's whatever, I'm not a big coffee person. But anyways, let's talk about weed. So I posted a video about weed um, and I made that video only like in real time. I made that video like maybe a month ago. I made it in February of this year, 2024. And... Um, and it was about how I'm trying to recalibrate my relationship with weed. I'm trying to, um, basically I'm trying to find a way to experience it again, almost like how you experience it for the first time. You know, like when you first start smoking weed, like it's such a novel experience and, um, okay, finally that noise is gone so my voice will be more clear but uh yeah whatever i won't get too into that but basically like i bought some weed from a place called uh weed hams hemp barely legal 
It's from Needham's Nursery. I don't know why this is not focusing. I'm trying to focus it. Needham's Nursery. But uh, it's really nice Kush. It's really nice. It's Indica, I believe. And, um, and then I also bought some joints. Oh, by the way, this shit right here is CBD. All of this shit is CBD. So it doesn't have any THC in it. But I, I buy that because I really enjoy the body high that it gives. It's like super nice. And the thing is, like, this place that sells it, they get it right off of a farm. So basically it goes from the farm to, they're not a dispensary. They're just like, they're a, um, I don't know what the word for it is. I know apothecary is a place where you sell medicines. And um, I guess you would call it a nursery is a place where you sell plants. So they basically sell basically household plants, stuff you can put indoors, so stuff you can plant outdoors. They sell seeds, they sell equipment and all that, but they also sell CBD products. And, um, but the CBD is at a, it's a uh, shipped from a local farm in Tennessee, local farm in Tennessee. So something right outside of Nashville and it gets delivered to the nursery every week and they sell them in these containers, which are basically like, I think it's almost three eighths. Yeah. It's almost, it's almost 10 grams or something like it's actually a lot of weed. Like if, if, I don't know if that, if holding it next to my arm shows you like how much it is, but like, it's actually a lot of weed. And then I bought this stuff from underground 420 called Han Solo. It's an Indica and I rolled some joints and, uh, that shit is super nice. But, uh, I had a bowl here smoking some CBD earlier today. And I got this really nice raw uh, clipper lighter, you know, with the stuffer in it. But yeah, so let me put this back down. So yeah, so uh, I didn't really have anything in mind for the video. All I wanted to do was make uh, new content and not just old. Because I've been uploading like old content for the past like week. Um... I started uploading content when I went to DC. I recently went to Washington DC and, um, I think in the video, I think in my welcome back video that I posted like maybe two or three weeks ago, like I put my Instagram and my Snapchat in my bio or in the description of the video. So if you want to go to my Instagram, I think I have a public profile. You can go in there and you can look at the pictures from my trip. I think I posted like four pictures. Um, they're all in the same post. And then I have like a little clip at the end of like me um, drinking some energy drinks like at the hotel or something like that. So yeah, but you know, this shit has a potent smell, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, I've been, I literally, I have been nonstop for like two, for like two or three weeks. I have just been like, not on a grind, but like I have been going through YouTube, Instagram and Snapchat and just stuff on the internet. Like I have been just going back and forth. All day, every day. I've just been going back and forth between these three apps on my phone. And I've just been like seeing like, oh, like are other people posting like content similar to mine? Are people like mentioning my channel? Like, am I blowing up? <laughs> Which I'm not. But um, what's really cool is if you go to your profile on YouTube. So you go to the bottom. It's on your phone. You go to the bottom left hand corner. You click on your profile. And then you can click on your statistics and it shows you how many overall views you've gotten like uh, since since you posted your first video. And I don't have a lot of views, but I have a thousand two hundred views on um, like overall. So all the views on my videos, on my long form videos and short form videos and and shorts on YouTube, I've gotten over a thousand views which is way more than I thought that I had because 
um, for some reason, uh, YouTube doesn't count my views all that well, but I think this happens to other channels, but like I've, it says that I've, uh, that I've had over a thousand two hundred views on my videos and I know that I posted a short about mirror meditation that got like, like 300 views, but all of my other videos on YouTube got like maybe 20 views at most. But the, if you do the math, like I posted like 20 videos and if each of them got 20 um, views, then that's only 400 views plus 300 for that, for that short is like 700. Um, but that doesn't account for the net for the other 500 views that are on your channel. And, uh, it, that's just a lot of views. If you really think about it, like to have for one video to get like 300 views, like that's a lot of fucking videos. It's a, it's unfortunate that like it was 300 views on a short, which doesn't contain a whole lot of information in it. It's not all that informative, but you know, whatever. So people are watching my videos and it's either a thousand, two hundred individuals watch my videos or it could be like 10 people are rewatching my video like four times. So that makes me feel pretty good. Like if, 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 if I only had like 10 subscribers, but they rewatched my video like four times, I'd be like, wow, like, okay, people really like my content. And I think that's what should be the focus. It's not like how many millions of followers you can get, how many millions of individuals. But if you just had a crew of dedicated people who commented on your channel or messaged you through social media and like you kind of kept up with them, like you kept up to date with them, like I think that would be like the sweet spot. You know, that would be like the middle ground. Cause like you're getting to know people who are watching your videos, you can get feedback from them. And, uh, you know, and, and the, and the, you know, the best thing, the best thing that you want for your channel is critique. The best thing you want is for someone to say like, Hey, I didn't really like your video. Could you try something else? And that, that might not necessarily change my mind. I might not necessarily like be like, Oh yeah. Okay. I'll make whatever content you want me to post. But like, I will be like, I will take it into consideration and I will think about it. You know what I mean? So anyways, what am I at right now? I'm at 12, I'm at 13 minutes and my phone battery is on like 50%. So I have, I have enough battery to make a video, but, um, yeah, I'll be definitely posting more original content, not original, but I'll be posting more content that, uh, is like new content and uh, I can talk about dreams. I can talk about, um, I can, I can talk about different things. It's whatever. Um, but there's not a whole lot going on in my life right now. I just got back from a vacation, like I mentioned, Washington DC. And I had a really good time with my brother and my mom. Um, and I saw my brother who is, uh, currently in the Air Force, and he has a base stationed in Washington, D.C., so we went to go see him on base, and then we took him off base to get some food and, like, look at the monuments and shit like that, so, yeah, that was really fun, so, uh, uh let me just talk briefly about, let me see how much time, 14 minutes, let me just, let me just talk briefly about the, uh, the channels that I watch, I'll like, I'm not sure if I just drop the names of channels that I watch because you can already see what I'm subscribed to, but, um, I've been like nonstop. I've been flitting between Instagram, Snapchat, and YouTube looking for lucid dreaming content, looking for people who are commenting on my posts, looking for like, and I would just like refresh the page, like refresh, 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 and like just see if like anybody like commented or anybody said anything. And, uh, that's just, that's just me getting all excited about like people like seeing my content. But, uh, yeah, I'll probably, if probably this is not the best time to make a video, which it's right in between my two sleep periods. 
I usually sleep from about 12 to like 4 or 5 in the morning and then I stay up until sunrise and then after sunrise I fall back asleep for a couple hours and then it it adds up to about 7 to 8 hours of sleep sometimes 9 sometimes even more but um I have slept for like 12 hours a day before yeah it's pretty nuts but yeah anyways um yeah, really, if you want to see more of my content, then just add me on Snapchat at Patrick Kennedy one or wait a minute. It's Patrick K E N N E, not with the D Y at the end. It's not the full Kennedy name. It's just Patrick and then K E N N E and then one for one. So uh, you can look at what I post this to Snapchat. I know it's not as Cinem uh, it's not as cinematic as YouTube. It's not as um, maybe informative as YouTube, but it's still where I like to post daily. And then you can check out my Instagram. And you don't even have to follow me, but if you did, that'd be fine. But you can just view my posts. Instagram is the thing that I use the least. I mainly use it to like DM people um, and talk to people, reconnect with people. But Snapchat I use daily. And, um, so yeah, you can just see interesting stuff on there. So anyways, have a good one. Have a good St. Patrick's Day. I'm going to be drinking a lot today, but then I'm going to quit. I'm actually quitting weed. I'm actually quitting weed and alcohol starting today. Or starting tomorrow, my bad. I'm going to be smoking today and drinking today. I'm going to be doing a, lot, a little bit of the crossfade. <laughs> going to be doing a little bit of the crossfade. But uh, mon starting Monday, um, I'm quitting all that shit. Not because it's bad for me. Not because I believe it's bad for me. But because, like, I just need a break. I need to lose weight and I need to start exercising, like, at 100%. Um, which I can't do if I'm fried every day. And I can't lose weight if I'm constantly drinking alcohol with sugar in it. So, yeah. But anyways, um... Leave a like, leave a comment if you want. Um, share this video if you want. But uh, just know that I'll, I'm I'm trying to upload all my old content in the next like week. I'm trying to upload all my old content, and then I will be making new content about different stuff. Hopefully, stuff like where I'm like going out to the gym or going out and like going places and like doing things and not just filming in my bathroom. I think I've graduated from that it's just it's six in the morning right now so i'm literally gonna i literally took a shower before i made this video and i'm just going back to bed so yeah so anyways peace